Well, what a game we have in store for you today. The hype has been building all week and the fans are pouring into the stadium. The tension palpable. Stay with us. We'll have all the action for you live right here on EA TV. Hello, great to have you with us, and this is the scene here at the Lusail Stadium, just to the north of Doha. My name is Derek Ray, positioned here on the commentary gantry, and sitting next to me, ready to give you all the analysis, is Stuart Robson. And it is a first test for these two countries here at the 2022 FIFA World Cup. It's Argentina, and they take on Saudi Arabia. Well, I'm looking forward to this one, Derek. It's so important that you get off to a good start. So let's hope both sides go for the win here and we get an exciting match. The Argentina first team. Well, when they don't have possession, it will be a back five. But when they win the ball back, the wing backs will push further forward to make it a 3 5 2. And a look at the starting lineup for Saudi Arabia. Thank well, they're playing in a 4 5 1 formation, which is set up to counter attack at pace. Yes, they'll play with a flat midfield out of possession, but when they win the ball back, they'll break forward really quickly. Let's hope they play it well today. And they kick off here. Nicely timed tackle. Going well. Well, nothing comes of it. It looked promising. Oh, a perfectly timed pass. He's managed to get in behind. A truly magnificent start. An early goal in the game. Just what they were hoping to produce. Well, here it is again, and the pace in which they break forward is devastating. It's so hard to defend against, but should the keeper be beaten at his near post? I don't think so. He really needs to do better in those situations. Back underway, and 1-0 it is. Let's see what happens next. Good pressure to win the ball back high up the pitch. The high press was very much on. After that fantastic effort, it's gone out for a throw-in. Messi. Oh, that's a really good run. Real chance. A goal! That's two for him today. They simply can't stop him. No wonder he's celebrating.
Well, here we can see it again. Look at the way he glides past the defender to create space for himself. And once he gets onto it, he just smashes it past the keeper with great technique. What an emphatic finish that is. So back underway with the lead standing at 2-0. The supporters want to see him have a go. Well, to think he only had the keeper to beat. Couldn't take the opportunity. Otamendi. Poor pass under no real pressure. Fernandes. Can they trouble the opposition this time? Almalki. Good pressure to win the ball back. Trying to really get at the opposition here. And the snuffing out of the cross there. Well, a classic example of how to intercept. Well, they've lost the ball. Wilting under the pressure, and now they try to go forward. A real opening now. Oh dear, a moment to forget all about, I think. Well, he has to do a lot better there. He's gone for power, but he's completely miscued it. He's going to be disappointed with that pass. Messi looking for the through ball. Oh, good work to deny the opportunity. The corner courtesy of Lionel Messi. Just a matter of thumping it away. Corner again. Playing it in. Well, no way through. Possession one. Messi. Alexis McAllister. Possession changing hands. And the attacking options appear plentiful. And he's in. Brilliant save. He read the situation defensively and did his job. Big chance! And determined to grab his hat-trick. Well, the way he's been playing, that was a chance for the hat-trick, but he just couldn't take it. Really good challenge. And a decent delivery. And a goal to seal the hat-trick! A masterclass in finishing. Just can't stop him today.
Well, here it is again. Messi's cross really invites somebody to go and attack it. And when he gets onto it, he decides to go for power. It's a really emphatic finish, which gives the keeper no chance. First half display, and just look at that score. Under a fair bit of pressure. Every goalkeeper would expect to catch that one. Error by the keeper, might give them a chance. Oh, look at it. it's gone in! The goalkeeper doesn't want to see a playback of that ever again. Well, here's the replay, and if you ask the goalkeeper to play up from the back, that's what can happen. It's a poor pass, it really is. And this is turning into something of a rout. 4-0. Otamendi. Now Romero with it. Enzo Fernandez. Here's Alvarez. Messi. Being egged on by the crowd. Oh, really close. Just over the top. Perfect tackle. Well, those stats don't surprise me. Argentina have certainly had more of the ball. Yes, they've played well when going forward, but it's been their ability to regain the ball which has made them so hard to play against here, and it makes them such a good team. It's been a brilliant performance so far. Now, can they create something? But it was down to whether or not he could beat the keeper. And that question has been answered. Well, I'm all for players striking through the back of the ball with power. But he has to hit the target from there. Well, totaling up all the stoppages, we'll have two additional minutes. Saleh Al-Shekhri. from the keeper will they seize on it well flinging himself at the ball he's driven in the corner High-class defending right on the goal line. And so it is, the first-half story has been written. Well, we're highlighting him for a reason, Stuart. He's putting in a really authoritative performance here. Well, what can you say about him today? He's been a real live wire. Full of tricks, great feet and good goals as well. Top stuff. Away they go again. Second half is underway here. Martinez. Towards Messi, far post. Oh, a moment of pure class. Had to catch it perfectly, and didn't he just?
Well, here's the replay, and it all starts with the delivery into the box, just begging someone to get on the end of it. And the strike could not get any better. He hits through the back of the ball with such power. What a goal this is. My goodness, it's so one-sided. 5-0 in this match. This could be dangerous if he's not careful. In the right place to cut out the pass. Alvarez. It's opening up for them. The supporters want to see him have a go. Oh, well hit, but couldn't keep it down. He's lost it. Saleh Al-Shekhvi. Well, no stopping him. And credit is due for that good piece of defending. Well, the conditions look pretty good for the counter-attack. Well, it looked highly promising, but it came to nothing in the end. And the flag raised. Offside it is. Perfectly positioned to take it away. It is a decent looking attack here. And let's give credit to the defending. Firing it in. Well, a powerful effort, but he couldn't quite keep the shot down. Oh, poor from the keeper. to the maximum and the goalkeeper left distraught huge error well here it is again and there's no getting away from it it's a big blunder he's just got that all wrong hasn't he An out and out pasting six nil. Alvarez getting in there to intercept. Teammates available. Opportunity it is. Well, here's the replay. Watch how he goes past his man with such ease, and it's just a change of pace. And when he gets onto it, he decides to go for power. It's a really emphatic finish, which gives the keeper no chance. Dulela Al Amri. And the pass could do damage. Well, he was on his own, 
He had the goalkeeper to beat, but failed to do so. Well, he just needed to show a bit more composure there. Take a little bit off the shot, I think. Sultan Al Ghanam and into the last 20 minutes. Oh, good looking run. And there is the goal. He's found the net. Joy unconfined. Well, here's the replay, and just look how quickly they break forward once they win the ball back. But there's still plenty for him to do. Under all sorts of pressure from the defender, he's just able to keep him at bay and finishes with a plumb. It's a great goal. Goal for Argentina. Saleh al Retaining possession, proving difficult. And he's made headway. Oh, marvellous goalkeeping. Well, it's a top-class save from a top-class goalkeeper. That's absolutely brilliant. Well, they have elected to go to the bench at this stage of the game. Fired over by Messi. Nicely saved. Well, behind for another corner. The corner courtesy of Lionel Messi. Pretty comfortable piece of defending. Can he fire it towards goal? Just can't get it past him. <laughs> Messi with the corner. Well, they weren't able to capitalise. Now well, the pass not finding its target. Martinez, and in with a real chance. Oh, there it is! It's one goal after another, and it speaks to the quality of that performance. Well, here it is again. He goes past his marker so easily with just a drop of the shoulder. But should the keeper be beaten at his near post? I don't think so. He really needs to do better in those situations. It's a massive lead, and it's very hard to imagine them losing it now. He's in behind. Oh, and it goes! Now he has his hat-trick. A special moment for him. Well, as you can see, he gave the keeper no chance there. He looked so confident, didn't he? That's a cool finish.
sadly we have to conclude that this hasn't really been a contest but all credit to any side committed to scoring goals like this oh a nice looking pass and tremendous goalkeeping well he just made it so difficult for the striker his presence alone just caused him a problem well great read there to intercept Well, that pass easy on the eye. Well, it looked like a decent avenue of attack, but he couldn't keep himself onside. Well, he's just a bit too eager there. All well and good playing on the shoulder, but he just needs to bend his run to stay onside. Well, nicely cut out. Now, what can they do with the ball? Well, wait, don't go anywhere. We're going to have five additional minutes. Oh, he's through here. And a goalkeeper on top of his game. Well, it's great goalkeeping. What a big save that is. Lionel Messi. Well, the header needed to be a lot better than that. Didn't really make the keeper work. Messi. Can he put it away? And a goal! He's doubled his total for the day in superb scoring form. Just look at this again. The combination play in the top third of the field was so precise, but the keeper should do better at his near post. That's gone in far too easily. That's not good goalkeeping. And the final whistle, a victory for Argentina. Precisely what their fans were hoping for, Stuart. Well, Derek, what a good performance that was. They did most things right, and their attacking play was inventive and had a real cutting edge. That was a really dominant display from them today.